What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. In the last video we went down into the mines, we got ourselves a little bit of iron. As you can see here, I got myself a full set of iron armor, which is very nice. And I got me some iron tools, a bunch of stone tools lying around. And speaking of stuff, we should probably put away some of this since we don't really need it right now. Like, you know, some of this wood, a bunch of these stone picks, this bow, this shovel. We'll keep the shovel, actually. We could probably use that. I think the primary goal for this episode, though, is to start planting some more trees around and also renovating my house. Because, as you know, my house is admittedly pretty boring. It's just a wooden brick with a door and, like, a button and just some stuff. And, you know, that's all well and good and, you know, that's, that's great and all. But honestly, I feel like I could be doing a bit more with this. And what do I need to make a blast furnace? Because I want to make one of those as well. Blast furnace. What do I need? Okay, that's a smoker. Uh, we just need some logs for that. That's really easy, actually. So a smoker is pretty easy. What about a blast furnace? That's kind of what I'm looking for. Unless that's uh, in a whole nother category, which I don't know why it would be. Okay, here's a smoker again. Cartography table. Dispenser. Iron block. Furnace. I want to make a blast furnace. How do I make one of those? It's not telling me. Might have to look that one up. But oh well, we, we can make a smoker pretty easily. We just need some logs. Got one log there. Do I have any more? I usually only have one log. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's almost dark. Okay. Well, we should just go to sleep then. So I want to chop down some trees. Mainly these acacia trees because I think they're kind of ugly and I really don't like them. And But uh, we can put them to good use though. You know, we can make the smoker. And we can make more animal pens out of it. Because I do eventually want to get some more animal pens going on here. Unfortunately, my axe is about to break, so I'm going to have to go make another one. Not too... not too long. There you go. As was expected. So we'll just go ahead and make another one. It won't be hard. And in the meantime, we'll go ahead and make that smoker. We can go ahead and make that. Yep, smoker. Easily. So this will help us cook food a lot faster, which is very nice. Go ahead and put that back. Uh, we just need some sticks. There you go. And just go ahead and make ourselves an axe. Very easy. And go ahead and chop down some more stuff. So go ahead and make those in the planks. Since we do want to put these trees to good use, I'm not just cutting them down for no reason. So uh, what I'm thinking for for the house, I thinking I'm, I'm, I'm I kind of want to make like an underground little area for it, and I just kind of oh, so how tall is that? One, two, three. So I think we'll make it about three blocks deep, and I think it's going to be like primarily storage. So I think we'll build it around the back here and just kind of like start digging into the dirt here. So we'll make it about three blocks deep, so or four blocks deep for that matter, because we do want one layer of dirt, and this will encompass the entirety of the house. And why do I have that going on there? Oh, 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 that's why, because that's where my door is, me idiota. Okay. Let's oh, just go ahead and replace that. We'll just have to head back up. That's fine. So this little underground area is going to be primarily storage based. And God damn it, you're already coming back into my house. The first chance you get, you're walking into my home. Stop it. Stay out of my house. It's not yours. 
It's mine. I swear I'm gonna end up killing that villager one day. So, you know, we'll just, uh... Okay, so that goes into there, which is fine. We're, I'm just, uh, you know, basically setting the parameters here. And this whole area is mainly just gonna be storage. We're gonna bust up our chests that we have in the house, and we're going to move them down here. Everything is going to be labeled, and everything is... Oh, we have a bit of iron there. Very nice. Anyway, everything is going to be labeled, and everything is going to be sorted. And speaking of sorting... Well, this has actually nothing to do with sorting. I really don't know what I'm saying. We need to, you know, make another stone. Stone shovel. Because I'm an idiot. Okay, stone shovel. Let's make a couple of those, actually. Alright. We'll probably give this a nice staircase and make it look, you know, like actually kind of like a, you know, nice... So, yeah, we can keep going past here. I kind of don't want the walls to be all like, you know, what, what do you call it? Uh, dirt. I can't believe I forgot the word for dirt. I, I'm just like completely, my brain is just gone today. But anyway, I don't want the walls to be completely dirt. Okay, so, oh yeah, I forgot my house doesn't have corners. And I gotta remember that. So, we can just, rem we can remove everything except the corner pieces. So, I might smelt down some stone from mining it anyway. And, you know, just kind of make this into kind of like a stone walled area but anyway we're gonna mine this iron here because it's there I can never go wrong with a bit of iron anyway we'll just replace that with dirt for the time being until we can get a better alternative anyway this feels like kind of a nicer area uh, even though this looks kind of jank but oh well it's not exactly centered, which kind of annoys me a little bit, but it's not enough of an annoyance to where I actually care that much. So there you go, it's nice and roomy in here now, so we're gonna grab some torches, place those. We'll place them on the corner bit since they're there. Uh, that doesn't look good, so we'll just place them like this. So there you go. We'll make some stone stairs to make that easier to get into and out from. And I think we have some spare doors, don't we? Thought I saw one. Yes, we do have some spare doors. So we'll just make some stairs. I think I have enough for a set of stairs. It's pretty easy. So we'll go ahead and make those and we'll place them. So, I guess they'll just go right here. Very nice. Look at that. Very, very simple. Very effective. Anyway, so this is primarily going to be our little storage area. As you can see, my inventory is very cluttered. And is generally just not in very good condition. So, I'll go ahead and place that door. Uh, yeah, this could use a bit of a roof, couldn't it? Or at least a bit of a covering. So, there you go. So we got our door there, we can enter, very roomy, underground little area. So chests can go, I guess, kind of like this, one, two, oh, that's actually perfect. We have chests pretty much everywhere, I think. So they're going to have like one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, one, two, one. Okay, that sounds good. I think I'll be able to make it work. I have plenty of wood for chests, so we'll just go ahead and make, like, a ton of those. Uh, yes, chests, where are you? We'll just make a ton of these, eight of them right now. 
And we'll just start placing them. We also need wood for signs. Got to remember that because we're going to label each and every one of these chests to make sure they are good. So, yeah, we you can place chests right next to each other. Always got to remember that. Uh-oh, that's not right. It's not what I wanted at all. There you go. So we have our first little set of chests here. So, you know, each chest will be dedicated to something. This will be stone. This will be ore. This will be dirt. This will be, I guess, coal counts as ore, too. Uh, this will be food. And uh, I think valuables will just kind of like be like iron and redstone and lapis, stuff like that. So, we're going to go home. Or we're already home, but we're going to go inside the main house area. And uh, I think we can, can we cover this up? No, I don't think we can actually cover that without, you know, breaking, you know, without not being able to walk on the stairs. So we're just going to bust up these chests. I know there's a lot here. There's a lot of crap. But uh, we need to pick up the chests themselves. Come on, give me the chest. Give me the freaking chest. It's right there. I'm looking at it. Stop. Oh, my God. Ugh. Thank you. Jesus. How hard is it to pick up a chest nowadays? Anyway, so we need to start sorting stuff before our items despawn. So anyway, this is food, so wheat and stuff is going to go in there. And I guess bone meal can go in there too since it's farming related. Go ahead and put all of our food in there. This is ore, so iron is going to go in there. Coal is going to go in there. Uh, this is stone, so anything made out of stone is going to go in there. And right here is going to be wood, so anything made out of wood is going to go in there. Be anything made out of dirt going in there. So wood. I guess iron nuggets also count as ore, so that's going to go in there. Uh, this is also going to double as a plant's chest, and this one is going to be a tool's chest. So all tools are going to go in there. And I guess arrows counts as tools. Uh, we have more dirt we can put away. Uh, wool and stuff, that might go into like a random chest, I think. So let's go back and pick up more stuff. Since I don't want any of it to despawn. So how much has been picked up? Not a lot, but we're just going to go ahead and throw it in. So this is stone, this is wood chest, so there you go. There you go, very nice. So this is the plant chest, so saplings and stuff will go in there. Uh, this is ore slash valuable, so that'll go in there. Uh, we need to go up and sleep. Because it is getting dark. And monsters will start spawning very soon. Come on items, don't despawn. Allow me to pick you up. Uh, right now, that's going to go in there, just for the time being. This is tools, so bow can go in there. Uh, gold and stuff, we have more tools, so we can throw those in there. Shears are also a tool. We have some lapis lazuli here, so that'll go in there. We have another chest here, so pop that baby right there. And uh, we got to make like a random chest. So, plant slash seeds, all that stuff is going to go in there. Saplings, all of it, make it happen. Diorite, that counts as stone, so that's going in there. Uh, that counts as wood, so that's also going in there. And a uh, string and wool and stuff, I think that's kind of going to be its own chest. This counts as food, so that's going in there. So, that. And I guess water bucket is also a tool. So, anyway, we're going to grab some wood. We're going to make some signs so we can actually label all this stuff. Alright, so that's that. And that is just enough for six signs. So this is stone. Phone slash rocks, other stuff like that. This is going to be ore slash valuables. 
This is dirt. Doit. This is food. Food slash plant slash farming. So there you go. This is wood, wood, and tools. Perfect. I don't like the way they converge. So anyway, in our food chest, we should probably get all of our melons back out because I'm a hungry boy. Alright. So anyway, we'll get our wood out and we'll make a couple more chests since that is a thing we need to do. Oh yeah, I forgot all this stuff that was here. Completely forgot about that. But anyway, I need to make more chests. So we can have kind of like a random stuff chest. Or just like a chest dedicated to wool or one for sand and stuff like that. Oh, I just realized. I can't place any chests there. Oh well. I guess you guys are just going to have to converge. Anyway, so this is going to be stuff for wool and glass. So why not? And so this is just going to be the random stuff chest. Anything random, miscellaneous, stuff like that, it's going to go in here. So more wood stuff. Go ahead and put the gunpowder and string in here. Wood, you need to go in there. And, uh... Yep, that's all going to be random, and this chest is going to go unused for the time being, but as you can see, we have a little bit of a, kind of a, you know, sorted out little area where all of our stuff is one place, and it's nice and neat, and it's very nice. So we have no more use for any chests right there, and we have a smoker here, which is very nice. So, what else do I want to do now that the storage area is mostly completed now? So, ore, valuables, good. Oh, we can smelt some of that iron. Uh, for wood, I think we, yeah, we need another sign, so we'll just go ahead and make that. We'll just go ahead and make another sign real quick. And man, these, uh, villagers, oh, lag spike there. These villagers' farms have been doing very well, actually. Might have to start harvesting some of that, but anyway, this is just going to be the random chest. Or a bunch of random crap goes. Let's start smelting some of this iron. Let me get some of that coal out of there. So, iron is being smelted. Let me check how long I've been going for, if my timer has been going. Alright, we still have a little bit of time left. But uh, I think I'm going to slaughter a couple of these sheep so I can actually showcase how the blast furnace works. But before I do that, we need to harvest some wheat. So, let's just go ahead and do that. Alright, that's a very nice. That's about, well, that's a decent amount of wheat right there. We need space for the melons to grow. Gotta remember that. <laughs> Alright, very good. Very, very good, very, very good. And we've got enough wheat so we can breed our sheep. So come, my sheeple. It is time to be bred. Alright. Looks like all of you have made the baby. So, it is time for slaughter. Three of you will suffice. There you go. I think four of you will be more than enough. Unless this guy wants to escape, which he's not, which is fine by me. So I can showcase the smoker. 
let's just uh, get some of that out of there. And as you can see, it cooks food very quickly, which is very nice. They have a bit more iron, so that can go in the chest. So, that'll go in the ore, this will go into the random chest, and this will go into the plants. Ugh. Sorry. I had to blow my nose. And anyway, I think today was a pretty productive day, if I do not say so myself. So now that, that all of that is out of the way, I think I'm going to end this video off here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I will see you guys in the next video.